It was this question on the floor of parliament that placed lay open MP Lujaya Kuza at odds with the government. Basically when you stand up and ask a question without notice on the honourable floor of parliament in the last session to ask whatever happened to the 1% to 2% of LNG project proceeds promised as a tithe, <coughs> promised as a tithe to the God of Israel in whom this country is in covenant with. Instead, on Wednesday this week, she was given the second from the People's National Congress Party. Kuza, on several occasions, as the then Community Development Minister, queried whether proceeds were already in the Kumul Church Trust Fund. Several MPs have come out in support of her boldness and condemned the manner of her second. And the manner and way in which uh, she has been uh, sacked from the party uh, is, a, is a total uh, uh, disappointment and disgrace to the people of Leyi and Morobe province. I asked the question and because the government had failed to fulfill its promise, that the government basically lied to the churches, she decided that she was going to speak up and as a result she was, she was kicked out in a very unceremonious way. Churches continued to be key partners in the delivery of services in the country where government presence is limited, especially in the most rural areas, and the proceeds would have contributed significantly to their operations. Northern Governor Gary Jufa has joined his colleague in calling on the government to honour its commitment. Mickey Cavera, National MTV News.